Tension pneumothorax is a life-threatening condition caused by the accumulation of air in the pleural space under positive pressure. This accumulation leads to the collapse of the lung, a shift of the mediastinum, and compromise of hemodynamic stability. It is essential to recognize that tension pneumothorax is a clinical diagnosis. Immediate intervention is required, and waiting for radiographic confirmation is not appropriate in unstable patients. Healthcare providers should remain vigilant for key clinical signs when assessing a patient suspected of having a tension pneumothorax. These signs include acute respiratory distress, unilateral diminished or absent breath sounds, hyperresonance on percussion, hypotension, tachycardia, and as a late finding, tracheal deviation away from the affected side. Recognition of these clinical features is critical to initiate prompt management and prevent further deterioration. The first step in the emergency management of tension pneumothorax is immediate needle decompression. A large bore needle or catheter, typically a 14 gauge or 16 gauge, must be inserted into the affected hemothorax. The traditional site for insertion is the second intercostal space at the midclavicular line. However, an alternative approach is to use the fifth intercostal space at the anterior axillary line, which may offer higher success rates, particularly in muscular or obese patients. Needle decompression is a temporizing measure designed to relieve pressure and stabilize the patient for definitive treatment. Following successful needle decompression, definitive management must proceed without delay. This involves performing a tube thoracostomy with connection to an underwater seal drainage system. The chest tube allows for continuous evacuation of air from the pleural space, re-expansion of the lung, and restoration of normal intrathoracic pressures. This step is essential to achieve full physiological stabilization and prevent recurrence of the tension pneumothorax. In conclusion, tension pneumothorax requires rapid clinical recognition and immediate intervention. Healthcare providers must act without hesitation based on clinical findings alone in unstable patients. Needle decompression provides temporary relief, while tube thoracostomy with underwater seal drainage constitutes definitive therapy. Prompt and effective management is essential to prevent fatal outcomes associated with this condition.